On this Martin Luther King Day, we meet a Milton Hershey School student turned staffer. She is sharing her personal connection to Dr. King's legacy. Sonica Bargo joins us now from the newsroom. Sonica. Alicia, in 1995, Fanati Abrokwa was in middle school when Coretta Scott King spoke to the student body at Milton Hershey School. More than 15 years later, that message has never left her. I understood that it was a huge moment then. A huge moment for then fifth grader Fanati Abrokwa. That was a once in a lifetime opportunity to have her grace our, our school with her presence. In 1995, Coretta Scott King, Martin Luther King Jr.'s wife, spoke to students at Milton Hershey School. Wow, the humility of, of this woman. King's message of service to become servants of God and humankind is still guiding Abroqua more than 20 years later. As you look back um, and want to give back to others and give back uh, to young people, and it's why I came back to Milton Hershey School. Abrogwa now works at Milton Hershey School as the special assistant to the president for diversity and inclusion. It allows us to keep equity at our forefront. This work, my role. Abrogwa says those principles of inclusion and equality are echoes of Dr. King's legacy. MLK really embodied a lot of the premises that we have here. As the school honors him this year, Abrogwa remembers Coretta Scott King's words. That's what but I remember her speaking to, that's what the holiday should be for us, um, is really giving back. And she hopes, like King did for her, she can make an impact of her own. I'm the first in this role, but hopefully that will inspire uh, other young women at our school, other young men at our school, um, to really come back and want to uh, give that service to our students as well. Abrokwa also told us the school is forming a team of people to look at how best to honor Martin Luther King Day in the years to come. She says they want to involve the whole community in serving others. Live in the newsroom, Sonica Bargo, ABC 27 News.